everybody. Welcome to my live where we are doing inking today and I am going to make a sweet little t-shirt that I've been meaning to make for a long, long time. So let me get to work on this one. Hi Holly. So I'm going to use the brush font. So this is what our brush font looks like. It's like a little scripty doo da. I've already kind of cut this apart so that um, I don't need to do that in front of y'all. And I will set aside all these other pieces. There we go. Okay. So I am making my Ill David t-shirt. I have been wanting to do this forever and my children keep making fun of me and they're like, oh my gosh, mom, like they don't get it. And I just have to, hi, Evelyn. Hi, Makaba, Ma Ma McCabe, I'm not sure how to say your name. Tell me how to say your name, Makaba. Kim, hello, hello, Jean. Rainy Tennessee, it's cold here in Michigan, very cold. All right, so let me show you my t-shirt I'm making. I will um, show you like this, I'm gonna get my ink. ink. Well, I guess I could do a this one because I'm not doing a really big one so it's literally going to say ill David ill David and um, yeah it's gonna be ill I kind of taped it off so I put the shirt on and so I wanted to see like where it hung on me so I like taped it off so that the words are in the right place. Hi, Jennifer. All is well here. We are doing quite well. Hi, Jan. Hi, Amy. Hi, Carly. Hi, Pam. Hi, Virginia from Georgia. Oh, thank you. I, I got this from some, I don't know, some online shop. Um, I actually don't even know. I Every Facebook ad gets me. Every Facebook ad. They're like, oh, cute clothes, and I click, and then, then I'm buying shirts, and clearly right now I'm only buying shirts because nobody sees anything below my waist, basically. Hi, Shalice. All right, so let's get this going. Um, I'm going to start with my ill and my comma, and I cannot wait to have this done. I guess I need to like figure out the center. So I taped it where I need that to go. Let me just go ahead and put this in here. And um No wrinkles, but it's stuck down. And then if I like, I think this is like the center. It's not always. I think that's pretty good. So if I do my L, L here, I'm gonna do it so that this hits right here. So then I can line this up with it after I do that. So I'm gonna, oh, I should be labeling these. This is a brand new transfer. 
I need to be labeling them. So this is the capital E, lowercase i, capital W, and the comma. All right, so, so this is what I do when I'm doing all of my letters so you know which ones Why do I have two eyes? This is the eye I need. Oh, this is an exclamation point! Ha! Ha! I am legit a dork. Okay, exclamation point. Whew. Okay. Wow, you guys. Do not have me teaching your children. And the lowercase a. All right, I got them all labeled. I'm glad we got through that. Hot dog, man. Hi, Diana. Hi, Anna. Hi, Jan. Janine. Janine, yay. Oh, if you love Shit's Creek, you're gonna love this because it's my Ew David shirt. Ew, David, I can't, I, can. I say it so much in my house that my kids are like, they're like, it's like that other thing she used to say. She used to always say that, that Linda thing. And I go, listen, Linda. And they're like, yeah. I'm like, you kids just don't know what's cool. And um, it was funny because I, I kind of cling to things like a little overboard probably. I'll say this for another six months. So I gotta wear my shirt. Hi Angie, hi Debbie, hi Shelly, hi Priscilla, hi Renee, hi Chris, hi Gail, hi Nancy. Woohoo, yes, shout out to Debbie, man. She did awesome today. Okay. So, ew, ew. It makes me happy just to say the word. Okay, um, I'm just gonna do white, because this is like a dark gray, like a heathered grayish black shirt. Y'all, I'm gonna wear it tomorrow, right? Um, and I get some squeegees. Ooh, my white is, you know what? Do not even fake like you're gonna turn off. My white ink is a little dry. Have you guys ever added water to ink? I, I'll try it, but I've got another one calling my name over there. This white ink is so old. You guys, it's like two years old. Um, over two years old. I have never added water to ink. Does it work? I don't know. We'll find out. But it's pretty thick. I should probably just open a new one. Yeah. It might just have to like sit there. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just be careful and open a new ink because Lord knows I don't need to mess this shirt up. I'll put a little water in there. I'll put the lid on and I'll let it sit overnight. So I'm going to grab me a new white ink to use. So we have a fresh white ink that we will be using. Oh, beautiful. Beautimous. Okay, got to throw away the lid. And now I have my white ink over here. Is this like all jacked up for you? There we go. Hi, Danelle. 
We're making a t-shirt tonight. Bruce. All right, well, we will see if, um, if it rehydrates. I just opened a new one and I'm gonna be happy with that. All right, so here we go. I do have tape, so FYI, I put some tape down. Uh, first I put the shirt on, <laughs> then I put tape where I knew I wanted those letters to go. And um, so that's why I have tape there. I have like the middle of the shirt-ish here. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my E and my little mark up here, my registration mark, because it's on the tape. Can you guys see I have tape here? Um, and I'm just gonna go over this a few times to make sure that my ink is on and it's soaking in. Okay, should be good. I just um, wanna make sure it's solid. Okay, so I'm gonna peel this off. My, my ink mat is under my shirt. So there's my E. Okay, now I could dry it a little bit, but just a little bit, because like just the outer crust of it. Reason being is I don't want to dry it all right now because my ink mat is under there and I don't want to heat it up. But if I dry it slightly, it will help when I do the next. Now, when you're using fabric, you do not fuzz your transfer. You want it as sticky as you can get it. Now I'm lining up on my thing right here. Okay, we're gonna go for the W. We're gonna go for the W. Ew, David. Looks pretty good. I do not need to do that other registration mark because it's my last letter. Ew, it looks so cute. I'm so excited. Okay, all right. Now, for the little comma, I think my comma, if I just Get a little bit on my squeegee. That should be good. Perfection. Perfection. Okay. Ew is done. He and this is such a cute font, you guys. It's called the brush font. Hi Carol. Hi Michelle. Hi Carol H. Hello, Sarah. Dude, you need to watch it from the beginning. Oh my gosh. Oh my, oh my, oh my. And you gotta get through, you gotta, you gotta stick with it. I have fallen in love with these characters so much and there's so, so many quotable things in this show. One of my favorites also, and you only know this if you watch it, but one of my other favorites is just fold it in. What do you mean? I mean fold it in. Well, how do you do that? You just fold it in. I, I freaking love that show. I can't. They're so near and dear to my heart. Those characters, I love them. <sighs> and Moira. Oh, good old Moira. Moira Rose. She's so awesome. Um, okay, so then the next word is going to be down on here. D-I. Well, we're not going to spell it wrong. D. 
A, B, I, D. So I'm going to scooch it over to start here and go over. I think that should be good. Hi, Nicole. The faces they make. I'm telling you, I'm I, like the faces, the... I think I need to rewatch the whole thing. It's like, I think there are six six um, um, seasons and you know, we watched it, we started watching it um, this year and um, obviously this year was their last season and so we are like five years out I guess but it's it's so good I can't really say much more than it just it's hilarious and then it's endearing at the same time D we got our D we gotta do our A next So I love I love David, but I also love um cut. I also love Alexis, a little bit of Alexis. And then I I love um Stevie. Like I just uh oh, Stevie is like you know, like she kind of steals the show at times. Her and David together make me, they're just like, they're so sarcastic with each other and like passive aggressive. It's like, it's like me. Um, in like, if I were in that situation, I, you guys don't know me like, well, you probably don't know me like that, but I, I am completely that I am a sarcastic fool. And um, I think <clears throat> every time I cough, my husband's like, do you have COVID? No, I just have a dry throat. Oh, we just finished Ozark last night. Oh my gosh. Speaking of my two favorite shows right now, we just finished Ozark and we have to wait a whole year or so. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. I can't, like I'm so spoiled by Netflix. I don't wanna wait, I don't wanna wait. Just, just, I want them all. I just want them all, I just want them all. Oh my gosh, it was so good. And I knew it was gonna happen. I called it. <clears throat> David. Moira and her, her wigs. Oh my gosh. Okay, now the B and the A are going to be connected here. We're going. Try a little bit more. <sighs> Little fires everywhere. Oh, I have not even heard of that. Is it, is it, um, what's it about? 
like maybe I need to watch it because I've just ended two of my like forever favorite shows. Well, until next year for Ozark. Wall of wigs. I know. Seriously. It was crazy. Oh, Alexis. Girl. And I think one of my favorite things is when she talks, is talking to Twyla and she's always like, Twy, I don't know. And she calls her Twy. And she calls her Twy. I don't know. I just love it. Everything about it. And if you don't, like if you never watched it, you aren't going to get me. So you got to watch it. Everyone has, that's your homework. You need to start watching. You need to at least get three episodes in at least before you come back here and talk to me again. No, it's your homework. Go watch it. Ooh, Amy also says Little Fires is a must watch. Okay. I'm so excited. I'm getting my Ew David shirt. I keep think I keep seeing it and I'm like, I could totally just order a shirt and why would I do that when I can make my own? Okay. Um, let me reiterate a few things before I finish this. We have our box this week, which is our um, grow box. Grow through what you go through. It's back there on my wall. Check that out. It's when I did a little bit of um, water paste painting. Um, it comes with everything you need to create what I'm pointing at right back there. Type box in the comments to get all the words um, or to get all the words, to get the information, to get all the deets. Type box in the comments and I will send you a message. So that box is this week and I still have a few more of the ink bundles. So if you didn't get a chance to grab that summary ink bundle, um, go ahead and type ink in the comments and I'll show you that one. But those are the two right now that I'm selling. Hopefully you guys can grab yours um, while I still have them. And let me think. Oh yeah, we gotta, I have to make sure not to take too long on this because at nine o'clock I have... I have a pop-up. I haven't done a virtual um, pop-up party in a long time, and I have three this week, so they are going to be fun, fun, fun. If you have not ever thought about doing like a virtual Facebook pop-up or a party, um, let me know. We can chat about it. I can explain how easy it is and how it works and how really I do all the work, and you earn free stuff. So, who doesn't love free stuff? Okay, it's a little off center, my David, but maybe I'll do two exclamation points and then it won't be so off centered. That's a good plan. Oh, there's a book too, you guys, I love. So, I love books, but I listen to them on Audible. I love listening to books. Maybe I should listen to the book and then watch the show or whatever, if that's what you're talking about. Also, if you guys, speaking of boxes and awesome goodies, if you haven't checked out our Club Couture lately, um, or you don't even know what it is, it's our cool subscription box. And, you know, subscription boxes are all the rage because who has time? Well, we can't even go shopping right now, but um, 
we have this really cool subscription. It's $19.99 a month. It is exclusive to the club, so you can't purchase the transfer or the kit anywhere else except when you join the club. And when you join the club, you're also becoming a preferred customer, and then you get discounts and specials right now. You get 50% off our textiles. Oh, I love it. Okay, we gotta set this whole thing. Now, um, so type club in the comments. We'll get you all the information through a little message. All right, so I'm gonna take my tape off and then, eek, and then, we need to heat set this. So every time you're working with ink, you need to heat set it because heat setting it is going to make it, that's not the one I want. I keep, where is it? Did I get rid of it? Oh, it's right here. It's the blue one. Fabric ink heat setting. So, we first need to take this um, ink mat out of here. So let me, all right, took my ink mat out. Now we need to dry it completely. And so I'm gonna do, use this. You can use a hair dryer. Um, hair dryers actually work really well because the whole point is to dry it, not to like heat it up. This is a craft heater, but it's quiet. That's why I use it. And it works for drying as well. So you can do this sometimes with shirts. I'll go on the inside and do this. Now this is a blend, this is not of 100% cotton, it's a blend. So what you do is you set your iron or your heat press for the fabric that you're using. It's different for everything. Cotton is like a higher setting, a blend, you're gonna make it a little bit lower. Um, if it's all like a totally polyester type thing, it's gonna be cooler than even that. So um, I don't know what your fabrics are. You can easily Google it, look it up. What temperature do I wanna heat set? I'm gonna remove this pad. Um, it doesn't do well with heat. And I'm gonna put this one out, protect my surface, and then lay this down. It's completely dry. Let me, let me let me show you how cute it is. It's completely dry and um, I'm gonna add a little parchment paper over the top and then we're going to heat set it. Now, for my um, particular heat press, it is 30 seconds at about 290. Normally I'm like at 305 for cotton. I put it down a little bit. Um, let me think. What else do I need to tell you? If you're ironing, you want to do both sides of your fabric four minutes. So you're like ironing four minutes on one side, four minutes on the other. So I'm going to give it a rest. This is 30 seconds. I'm going to shake it out. And I'm gonna turn it inside out. And I'm gonna heat, okay. Tape marker. So the tape is CC tape. It, it is chalk couture tape. It is our placement tape. So if you are shopping in the tool section or accessory section, you'll notice that it says that it has placement tape. Um, it has like a little ruler on it. So you can use it for placement or um, for, like what I just did. It's based in Shaker Heights, Ohio. Ooh. 
is that the only way you can do the letters? Is that the only way to do it? They're out of stock on tape. Boo-hoo. I have some here. Um, hi, Sheila. Can you use an easy press? That, Holly, is what I'm using right now. So, lucky you if you have one. But like I said, you just want to look up those directions. Ha! Yeah, that's funny. Hi, Julie. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Pam. All right, so I definitely have to look up that show. Um, oh my gosh, I'm super excited about how this turned out. Um, taking those directions down. You guys know if you're new, type add me in the comments so that I can give you the link to join my free VIP group, which you definitely want to be in. Um, and then if you are curious about becoming a designer, I would love for you to type team in the comments and I will get you a link to join my opportunity group where you can watch a cool video that tells you all about everything you need to know before you make your decision about becoming a designer. So if you're curious, you wanna know like, is there a discount? Do we make commission? Like all that stuff, all the answers are in the video. Right now, Eo David is my awesome shirt. I am going to show you, I'm gonna hold it up. Isn't it cute? Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. I'm gonna wear it tomorrow. So I'm gonna do my live tomorrow. I'll look like this. Ew, David. Um, and yay, if you love this, this is ink. Ink is so super easy, it's permanent. This is gonna go through the washing machine, through the dryer, and it stays. I have so many shirts and things that I've made for myself and for my children and my husband. And um, they have been worn and washed and worn and washed and worn and washed and they stay really nice because this ink soaks into the fabric. It's awesome. It does not just sit on top. Um, yes, Holly. Yes, yeah, so just wait. I have more t-shirts that I really need to make. Um, but I had to do this one tonight. I am off now. I gotta go do my party and um, I'll let you guys know how it went tomorrow. But in the meantime, if you need anything, let me know and um, message me and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks everyone. Sarah, you missed me, but look. Do you watch that show? I don't even know. Ew, David. If you don't, everyone's homework is to start watching Sit Shits, Shits Creek tonight. It's not a bad word, it's a last name. So um, yeah, go watch it and then, then and check back in with me tomorrow. tomorrow. 8 p.m. What is tomorrow? Friday? Oh, it's Friday Eve. Tomorrow is Friday. 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Eastern Time. I will be here. Will you? Hopefully. Bye, guys.